Hey, welcome to Be Me. Thank you for watching again. And stay tuned to see this tutorial on this beautiful makeup look, this purple and pink makeup look. So if you like what you see, just keep watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Peace. Okay, so we're gonna go into the 88 color matte eyeshadow palette from BH Cosmetics. Into this brown right here with a MAC 224 blending brush. We're just going to put it in our crease. Hopefully you can see that. And just blend it, just buff it out into your crease. To the Wet n Wilds palette called Art in the Streets. Yes, Art in the Streets. It's just a one, two, three, four, five, five eyeshadows. You can see it here. And the color we're going to be going into is this purple right there. I'm gonna put that over my lid. Lid the flat shader brush like this. And just go all over your lid. Use CoverGirl Queen bronzer and ebony bronze. I'm using a smaller um, kind of tapered blending brush to blend that bronzer inside my crease. I'm take our MAC 224 blending brush and just buff that brown out. Darken our eye look up. We're going to go back to the the first palette that we used, which is the BH Cosmetics Matte um, 88 Matte Color Eyeshadows. And so we're gonna go dip into this dark purple just to deepen the crease up a little bit, not a whole lot. We're using the small tapered blending brush and tap it in the corners first. And then create a V, a very, very small V because we don't want it to be overpowering. I'm kind of taking it up to the, like up to the brown bone right here to extend. So I kind of open my eye up a little bit more. So it creates like a, I don't know, like a shadow. I don't know how to, how to really explain that. But just follow what I do. I'm going to take the MAC 224 and, kind of, and just blend that out. And with another flat brush like this, we're going to go into your uh, face powder. Mine is um, Stay Matte But Not Flat by NYX. And then my color is Chestnut. And I'm applying this neutral tone shade to my brow bone highlight or as my brow bone highlight. To complete your eyes, just do a wing liner and lashes of your choice and come back. And we're gonna finish the rest of the face and the lips. We're gonna take the Jordana pencil, 12 hour made to last eyeshadow pencil in number 04. It's continuous almond, and so it's basically a nude. Um, but it's very, very smooth and pigmented, and it only costs like two dollars or whatever. And so we're gonna put it on our bottom waterline as so. So it's not white, it's like a nudish, cream-ish color. Yeah, I have an orange blush on, and it's by NYX. 
scent is called cinnamon. It looks like this. Cinnamon, it's just an orange, pretty, pretty color. And it's just a single blush here. And you know my Ruby Kisses All Over Glow and Flushed Glow Bronzing Powder. Looks like this. And it's also like two or three dollars at your um, beauty supply store. It has like a pinkish golden blonde, pinkish golden like bronze kind of like I'm awake, I'm glowing. Yeah, it's my favorite. Mariposa Deep Purple. And that's the color. It looks like that. It looks like this color right here. And we're just going to put that and define the edges of our lips first. Define a little bit because we are using a bright, bright pink, and it's called Shocking Pink by NYX. Over here, it's really bright, bright pink. Spray yourself down with e.l.f. Makeup Mist and set. Here is the completed look. It's like a really pretty purple um, eyeshadow and everything, everything, everything. Yes, so here's the finished look and I hope you love it. Thank you for watching.